What's going on, guys? Welcome to a day here at Dub Saw Shop. Right now, we are walking down to the shop. We're going to break out this Poland 325. And we're going to do some runs with that. I'm excited to run that for the first time. Get it out here with the 325 chain on it. See what we can do, man. Uh, yeah, I'm really excited about this. We got us a bunch of wood here we can test with, play with. Man, it smells amazing out here. We cut that big, big piece there with the 395 yesterday. Um, we cut on this piece as well. And the other one that we cut was right here. That thing, man, it had some knots. And it was very, it's kind of a weird spot. It was like a decent little crotch where a big limb came off of, maybe. But, yeah, we put that thing to the test, no doubt. It's pretty big stuff. So yeah, we are going to come out here and do some ripping with this 325. Alrighty, going to get that. Be right back. Pretty clean saw. 53 cc's. We have pulled the muffler screen and the baffle out of it. Got a brand new Oregon Versa Cut bar and it's running 325 steel RS RS chain. Now let's see what we got. This thing's got a ton of compression.
possibly the 346 XT. I got a 346 XT and that is definitely one of the tests that we're going to do for it. Put them up against each other and see about how similar they are. Cuts great. Uh, torque is very torquey. It's 53 cc's I believe it was. It is very torquey for a 53 cc salt. Uh, the only thing I do with, I wish it had dogs on it, and I know you can still buy them, so that's definitely something that I'm going to look into doing here in the very, very near future. Because I actually do like this saw. Um, it runs great, man. It runs amazing. It's got plenty of compression. This all stock. Hasn't been ported. Uh, it's just got, a, a, like, a base, basic muffler mod really wouldn't even call it a muffler mod the baffle plate and the screen has been removed man it sounds amazing i love the way this all sounds yeah so what else can you say about it man it's, i know these pretty these saws are pretty hard to come by from what i've my research on them everybody seems to love them they're kind of the same as like the Johnson Red. I think it's four ninety five ninety. The Partner five hundred, five thousand, five thousand plus. They're all pretty similar, but they got differences as well. But we got a three twenty five man. I'm excited about that, guys. Uh, 
Hope y'all like this video. Y'all come back, see what else. See what we're gonna have in store for this thing in the future. May may get ported. Definitely gonna be getting some muffler work done to it. And we gotta find us a choke rod. So if anybody knows anywhere where you can get a choke rod, feel free to send me an email at dubsawshop at gmail.com or just leave me a comment and I'll get back with you and we'll get together and see about getting one. So thank y'all. Y'all have a great rest of your weekend. Dubs, we out. Well, we just ran the 325. Runs good. And I was thinking about something. What do y'all think about this hat? So this is my pole and wild thing hat. Guy on Facebook made. Don't pay attention to the crazy hair. But. Polling on the back. Wild thing on the front. I really like it. It's a little chilly out here, so I'm going to wear it. I just got to fold it up a little bit. But I think it's pretty cool. What do y'all think?